Hello, everyone. Guess what time it is? As you probably can tell by the title, it is yet another round of Hobby Lobby clearance items. So I'm starting off with this Prismacolor set that you see here, and I know with a price tag of $40, you're probably thinking, What? Huh? But if you're in the market for them, they probably are a better deal to get them in this pack because, you know, alone on their own, like these type of markers can range anywhere from like five to eight dollars. Plus you're getting a set of 24. If you need to look at the colors a little bit longer, don't forget to go ahead and just hit the pause button. This is the top set. This is the first 12 markers that you're getting. And then this one is the bottom set, the next 12 markers that you're getting. So if you kind of do the calculation on it, you're looking at around $1.67 per marker, which is actually a pretty good deal, right? You're probably going to need all of these markers because of all the different stamps that are on sale at Hobby Lobby. And you've probably seen that throughout my other videos. Speaking of stamps, how cute is this chicken stamp right here? This is by AI. It's $3.49. It has really cute sayings. It says, the early bird can have the worm. I'll see you at noon with a latte. Happy birthday to one fabulous chick. Hello, spring chicken. Oh, what a bird brain. I forgot your birthday. And she's carrying a cup that says, oh, frap. And it says, poultry in motion. Aging is not for chickens. And here's a little coop cake to, coop cake to celebrate your birthday. Oh, like a chicken coop, coop cake, cupcake. <laughs> Speaking of chickens, so as most of you know, or at least in my area, it's all over the news. Popeye's new chicken sandwich. I believe there's a shortage of it out there. Luckily, I was able to try it. So it's promoted as classic or spicy. And I said to myself, there is no or, there's only an and. So I would like a classic and a spicy sandwich. And I have to say, this is a really hearty piece of chicken. Like sometimes when you buy a sandwich, the chicken is really, really tiny. And then you have a whole lot of bread. It's like the opposite on this one. You have have a really huge piece of chicken as you can see. Wow! This is actually one of the best examples right here where the chicken is actually bigger than the bread. So yes, I was really, really happy with this sandwich. I can see why there's a shortage of it. <laughs> Everyone wants to try it out. Full disclosure, I hope you guys are bringing your appetite as well as your love for crafting to this haul video because it's going to be a mixture of my food adventures as well as all the sales that I find at Hobby Lobby. So you may need to look for a new lunchbox. Yeah. All these great bargains may be burning a hole right through your purse, so you may need to make another one, in which case they have this. <laughs> Or better yet, just get one of these scrapbook totes. They're also on sale and you can fill them up with all of your goodies that you find at Hobby Lobby. And you're probably thinking to yourself, you are talking way too much about food right now. And I will blame it on this washi tape that I picked up. It was all about food. I know it's weird, but for some reason, I feel like I need to give excuses as to why I'm showing you all this junk food, right? <laughs> but I have to say, I did not eat all of this in one setting. It was actually throughout the course of a couple of months and plus, since the weather is really, really hot, I try not to actually use the oven because then the AC bill is going to get really, really high, right? Oh, no. We have the little takeout boxes on the washi tape, and I figured why not go to Panda Express and check out their new hot Szechuan chicken. And I figured I was there already, so I might as well invest in the Panda Feast. Actually, I think they're calling it the Family Feast now. So you'll probably need some of your party staples, which you would look for at Hobby Lobby because some of the tablecloth covers are on sale. You don't like tablecloth covers, then you can also look in the fabric area because as you can see, there's a lot of really beautiful fabric out there and it's really nice fabric. It's a really nice ritzy type of fabric that you can buy and for only $3 on up, it's actually a pretty good deal. I had to stop myself from buying it because last time I spent a lot on the fabric. <laughs> so I held off on it this time around, but it's a lot of really cute fabric out there. Oh, and also the embellishments, the trim on the fabric, that's really cute and that's also on sale at Hobby Lobby. Um, and then if you don't want to invest in all that, then go back to the party section. And even if it's not for a birthday, if you need some paper plates at a really great price, those were on sale and some napkins. And what else? Oh yeah, going back to the Panda Feast. So yeah, for $35 or starting at 35, you're gonna get your three large entries or entrees and your two large sides. And as you can see, when you put it in plates, it actually looks like a whole lot. So <laughs> if you wanted to fool people into thinking that you cook, this is also a really great way to do that. <laughs> but if you don't wanna wash dishes, then you can keep them in the takeout boxes. Yeah. 
this washi tape says want to talk about it. I'm telling you guys, I blame the washi tape because also at Burger King, there is the new taco or the re-release of the taco. <laughs> More really cute washi tape. This one says, I think my soulmate might be carbs. Exercise, extra fries. Um, coffee and donuts equals BFF. That is so true. And it says, treat yourself, treat yourself, treat yourself, treat yourself to donuts that are hot and fresh. And you guys might want to grab this stamp set because you guys are going to be looking for the address of this next place I am taking you guys to, which is going to be Krispy Kreme. <laughs> But I have my mom to thank for this little food stop. So I went over there because I knew they released these new Reese's donuts. And I was like, oh, my mom really loves Reese's. And let me pick it up. So yeah, it was like almost an hour or so drive to get there. <laughs> and then when I was there, I was like, okay, well, let me pick up some other ones just in case. And then I went to go pay. And then I saw that they actually had these little cute boxes. And I was like, okay, you're going to have to give me one of those too and fill them up. Because now I have to give this to my mom and this cute little presentation of a box. So these are the chocolate lovers and the peanut butter lovers and I saw reviews about these some people really didn't like it I'm like it tastes like a Reese's to me I don't know maybe they made it really good at my Krispy Kreme I liked it <laughs> Um, and so the um, Reese's hunt continued because like when I went to the store, I saw all kinds of Reese's things. So I was like picking them up for my mom. <laughs> she doesn't eat chocolate all too often. She usually likes eating the dark chocolate, but like her favorite are the Reese's. So when she does eat her sugary goodness, it's going to be a Reese's candy. So this is the cute little Reese's package I got my mommy. <laughs> I bought the stamp set earlier, but I don't think I was able to fit it in my other haul video, so I'll show it right now. Really cute set. It says, sugar, flour, eggs, and more, a birthday cake with candles galore. Life is what you bake it. You make everything butter, and all you need is love, and the need is spelled K-N-E-A-D, and I really just love all the sweets on here, especially that oven that's pink. It's so cute with a little batter on top of that, and this is another alphabet stamp with some numbers, so... Yes, I did not count any of the calories to what I was eating or showing. <laughs> um, but I guess, you know, to make up for that, maybe take on a hobby, like um, a sport maybe, or maybe even hula. Um, I guess that if you are doing hula, you might need some good music. So they also had this there. And I should say that this is a yellow sticker, not the orange sticker. So I don't think this is the full 75% off. But if this is something you're interested in, I would probably keep an eye on it. It might get discounted later on. I'm not sure. Maybe do a little plant-based food. So you guys know of the traditional Whopper. You probably heard of the Impossible Whopper. So yeah, I decided to try that out too. It is no beef. It is 100% plant-based. It is used on the same broiler as your Whopper, but you could also ask that it not be used on that broiler if you wanted to. Um, so I figured I would just give it a go and look how perfectly circle this is. I don't think it looks anything like the little picture that it came with, <laughs> but that's okay. It actually really tastes, it, I don't think it tastes exactly like a Whopper, but it's good. Like I wouldn't really be able to say like this is plant-based. So yes, I enjoyed eating that and a lot of other goodies. And I forgot to say, going back to the little chicken um, stamp earlier, did you guys know that Chick-fil-A also also released their new mac and cheese and that is so super yummy and delicious like super yummy and delicious I went there on the day that it was actually released and of course I had to pair it with chicken so this is what I bought um, yeah so I hope you guys enjoy today's special haul video with my love for crafting and my love for eating <laughs> And I think maybe there might be some Michael's grab bags or boxes coming out. I keep calling my store. They keep telling me, check in within a week, a couple of weeks. So <laughs> that's what I've been doing. So hopefully that's going to be the next video that I make. 
In the meantime, if you've bought grab bags or boxes in the past and you need some project ideas, don't forget to check out my other Michael's Grab Bag videos. I thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you all have a very wonderful day. Mm -hmm.